Hello everyone, I am Ravi, Professor of Mechanical Engineering. Today our topic is isometric view of a, a cone with different orientations keeping axis vertical and axis horizontal. And let us consider the dimensions of the cone, base diameter is 60 mm and height of the cone is 90 mm. So in today's lecture, from today's lecture you will be learning cone, how to draw within 5 minutes. Let us observe carefully and uh, whenever you are uh, drawing isometric uh, view or drawing of a cone, orthographic projections are not required. And uh, let us uh, solve the A bit that is keeping axis uh, vertical. For that, let us draw a horizontal line and to the right of it is at an angle 30 degrees and to the left it is 30 degrees and complete the parallelogram with the diameter that is 60 mm i size. So let us complete the parallelogram with the dimensions 60 mm and uh, you have a larger diagonal and shorter diagonal and the shorter diagonals are automatically just two centers. Let us mark one and two and uh, join this one with midpoint of opposite sides. So this is midpoint and this is midpoint join with the midpoint of opposite side. Similarly, join two with the midpoints of opposite sides so that uh, you are going to get uh, two more centers with intersecting points and this is your three and uh, this is uh, four. Now you got uh, four centers. And one eye center, radius as this length, draw a circular arc. Similarly, two eye center, join these two with the same radius. And the third point eye center, the small length is radius. Similarly, same radius, you got that fourth. The base of the cone is completed now. Join longer diagonal and shorter diagonal. The intersecting point is your midpoint. From this midpoint, let us measure the given height that is 90 mm. Locate the apex at a distance 90 mm and join this apex, draw a tangent to the parabola and you are going to get the required, you know, cone and obviously as you know that this becomes hidden and in isometric uh, drawing you can always it is preferable to avoid the hidden edges and that you have avoided and this is what is uh, the first keeping axis vertical and now let us proceed to keep that axis horizontal in that uh, let us draw the front view and for that uh, let us consider the vertical line and uh, at an angle 30 degrees complete the parallelogram with the dimensions 60 mm right you got the shorter diagonal this is center 1 and this is center 2 right and join center 1 with the midpoint of opposite sides 2 as midpoints of opposite sides and you got uh, the intersecting points so this is uh, 3 and this is 4 now, one eye center join these two points and two eye center join these two points, three eye center, semicircular arc and four eye center. Now, what you do is draw a line at an angle 30 degrees with the horizontal and uh, locate the midpoint by joining longer diagonal and shorter diagonal. From this point, draw a line parallel to 30 degree line parallel to 30 degree line and locate the apex at a distance 90 mm from the center and uh, join the apex to the ellipse draw a tangent and so that uh, your isometric view keeping axis horizontal is completed. So this hardly takes uh, 5 minutes and uh, I hope you have understood uh, clearly how to draw this and you can practice now. Thank you.